Hey guys, I thought I would do this video of my hermit crab enclosure tonight. There aren't any hermit crabs out, but they're all burrowed down, just waiting for the light to go off, and they'll come right out. They are nocturnal. So I have them in this 10-gallon tank. There's some of my newer pets here. They're fun to keep. And they're pretty messy little things for such little guys. I have four in the 10-gallon here. You can see that first they have their freshwater pool over here, and that does have an aerator. It boosts the humidity a little bit, kind of fun to watch. And they have some plants, vines up here. This is just a bio vine that I got at the pet store bent around some choya wood. This side of the enclosure is um, mostly sand substrate, as you can see there, but I did layer the top with just white gravel. It's more visually appealing because they do manage to get the sand pretty dirty. Over here we have eco earth. So they can really burrow anywhere in the enclosure, but they tend to burrow over on the eco earth side. Driftwood here, lots of different wood sculptures, plenty of shells to change into. They have their little saltwater dish over here with some rocks around it and a little hide back there. I did have a, a little coconut hide in here, but I changed that out because one of my little hermit crabs changed into a, a bigger shell and could no longer fit inside very easily, so I used the, the half coconut for my crusted gecko. And back there they have the hygrometer and temperature gauge, the thermometer, so I can monitor that pretty closely. Again, lots of plants and decorations. I tend to use plenty of those in all my enclosures. A couple of sea sponges, or sponges over here to keep humidity up. And then I have, right now I'm feeding raspberries, grapes, and then just a little bit of freeze-dried shrimp and some hermit crab diet back there. They do have the climbing background here. And you might think it's pretty impossible for them to climb, but I have seen many a hermit crab climbing the background here to get up to the vine setup I have here. So they do use quite a bit of the enclosure. They're mostly out at night, but they are fun to watch. Got my supplies down here. It's a pretty good place to keep the tank. It gets a little bit cool in this room though, so I do have quite a few heating pads on the back, on the sides there as well. That's just about it. You've seen most of my Crabitat. Again, I'll take your subscriptions, comments, and any requests as usual if you want to see more of this tank or any of my others. Just comment, send a message. Thanks for watching.